All right, what is going on YouTube? So I was browsing around the forums and I came across a nice DIY for a clutch stop. Um, and everyone has good reviews on it. So I figured I might as well pick up the parts and nothing crazy. You can just go to Home Depot. They got everything you need. Uh, and it has these heavy duty skid pads. You need one of those, four of these rubber uh, one and a half inch washers, matches the diameter of those. Got a one inch screw and then a random ass uh, drywall anchor that is found around. So let's see if we could pop out the stock uh, little cap for the clutch stop and then insert the anchor. And then we're gonna see how this works. And I'm probably gonna remove the uh, clutch assist spring while I'm in there. So. Let's go out to the car, see what we can get going here. All right guys, so as you can see, I have the skid pad first, and I have four of those washers afterwards. So it creates a little bit of thickness right there. Then I got the screw going through, and then I already popped off the little cap on the car, inserted the, um, the anchor in there, in, into that hole. And then now we're just gonna go ahead and screw this in and give it a try. All right guys, so here we have the finished product. We got the skid pad and we got four of the washers. And then as you can see, I just screwed it in there. It's nice and snug. It's not going anywhere. And then you press down the clutch pedal. As you can see, there is your DIY mod, works nicely. Also remove the uh, clutch assist spring. Um, it just kind of comes off this little hook right there press the clutch all the way in and then pull down and it comes right out all right let's give this a try here press the clutch all the way in and i'm just gonna pop it down with like a little now i'm here testing out the car and driving it around stopping good traffic, red lights and everything like that. And I can notice a pretty good improvement from the clutch pedal. Like there's less uh, travel, a little bit less travel. And the thing that really was a better improvement was removing the clutch spring. So remove the clutch spring, the pedal just feels way more organic. Like it doesn't feel so assisted because the way the car came with that spring, like it's basically saying, everyone's a rookie driver like let's help them out with the clutch pedal that's basically how it felt just way too assisted um the first the second gear shift was just shifts are just terrible like it's hard to get them down perfectly every single time um so with that spring removed the clutch pedal definitely feels a lot more organic it's easier to control um and it's not like it got heavier or anything like that it basically feels the same so you're just getting a lot better feel you can control it a lot better and that i really do like so that's my initial thoughts on it so far um i think the thing that's going to improve everything the most and just get the most raw feeling clutch pedal is to do the bleeder block uh, upgrade you can get the ecs bleeder block or you can take apart the stock bleeder block and remove the little yellow uh, diaphragm piece in there it's basically to restrict the fluid i don't know why they put that in there uh you know on a gti or a golf r but um, you know it's in there so i feel like that's gonna really improve the clutch pedal right there in that mod but for these two mods that you could do literally for less than ten dollars and removing the spring is free so you can just do that anytime you want and it's reversible 